there are those who are continuing to propagate a lie that we can have a multiple choice referendum. And they are propagating this lie when they have been in government, they held the Constitution of Kenya and swore by the Constitution of Kenya and held the highest offices in the land. And the Constitution of Kenya, when it talks about a referendum to change the Constitution of Kenya, it provides for a process which ends in the referendum vote on a bill, not on a multiple choice question. That is not there in the Constitution. And this is part of the lie that has been propagated by those who should know better. Sometimes they say they take a little bit longer to, to learn or to read, but I know this is pure mischief. These are people who are not prepared to have Kenya move forward as a nation. And therefore, we are calling upon Kenyans and all people of goodwill that we have reached the level in which the train has left the station and we are going to a referendum where the, everybody in this republic has a choice to say no or to say yes. To say no or to say yes. And the question that I keep on asking, all these good ideas that they are talking about at the 11th hour, in the last 10 years, more than 10 years, when they have been in position of responsibility, they should have come up with these ideas, even to change the law to enable the uh, country to go through a multiple choice a referendum, which on the question of a constitutional amendment bill is not provided for in the Constitution. And lastly, I have never seen in a republic where the government as a whole, the head of state has taken a position on a major political question and there is dysfunction in government. And the vice president, or rather the deputy president, the constitutional provision regarding his office is to assist the president of the Republic of Kenya, to assist the president of the Republic of Kenya. And I hope that in the fullness of time, he is going to see the wisdom in trying to move together with his head of the party, head of the government, and head of, of state. But we as ODM, under the leadership of Raila Molo Dinga, we have made a choice after the handshake that Kenya can be made a better country. And this referendum is coming in order to make Kenya a better country, not to give anybody a seat in government as a, an individual or as part of the community. All these constitutional amendments are based on the nine principles which Uhuru Kenyatta and Raila Amolo Dinga put their hand in March the year 20. 18. And therefore, I, I hope we are going to move with speed and ask the people of Siaya County Assembly that when this bill comes to the County Assembly in Siaya, they will lead the way after public participation to vote in favor of the bill. And that sometime in April next year, the people of Siaya will be in the forefront to vote for the bill and amend the constitution in the manner provided by the, the, the amendment bill, the proposal that we are going to put forward before the country.